Okay, so the first story I want to talk about is Barack Obama, really, and his Nobel Peace Prize win. I'm sorry, but I mean I like Obama. First of all, I mean don't don't say I don't like him because I actually do. But really, leave a comment or video response telling me. What do you think Obama has done so far? I mean, he hasn't done a lot. Like, when the Nobel Peace Prize um, deadline for nominations had begun was in February. He didn't really do that much in February. He really had been in office for like, maybe two weeks. What did he do in two weeks that made him deserve the Nobel Peace Prize? Do you agree with that or disagree? Do you agree that Obama should have won that? Or do you think someone else should have been more deserving of that? I believe someone else would have been more deserving of that. Because two weeks in office and he deserves the Nobel Peace Prize. And some people have devoted, like, years of their life to charities and stuff. And do they get a Nobel Peace Prize? No, they don't. So, what do you think about that story? Do you think Obama deserves the Nobel Peace Prize? Does he not deserve it? Do you not care? Leave a video response, comment, telling me what you think. Okay, and the second story I want to tell you about is just... In my opinion, just pure stupidity. So about four or five months back in the summer, um, they fired a missile or a rocket or whatever off the earth in hopes that it would hit the moon. At first, watch you, I'll put the link to the video somewhere um, showing you what it was supposed to do. It's supposed to like go around the earth two times or something then hit a crater on the moon where they think water is supposed to be. So if we discover water on the moon that's kind of big, hydrogen, oxygen, H2O, you know, oxygen to live and stuff. So we could live on the moon but it really just makes me mad because the way I feel that they probably planned this, they probably just said, okay, we're going to shoot a rocket at the moon and hope that there's water on it. Now, what's plan B if it doesn't work? Because, you know, the moon is what makes the ocean currents, like, go. And if there's no moon, there's really, like, no ocean currents moving. And that would mess up a lot of cycles in life, and that would basically mean a lot of species and stuff would be screwed. We might be included on that list. And if you even have water on the moon, it'd have to be pressurized. Because it really, the moon has a very thin atmosphere. One of the all in physical science too. Yeah. So, really, Why are we going to go to that much trouble to live on the moon? I mean, I, I understand this could be like a huge discovery. Water on the moon. We can now live on the moon. But the risk it involves shooting the moon and hoping that it doesn't screw up the earth. That is just a big risk in my opinion. What do you think? They shot it at the moon or like five months ago it hit at 4.30 yesterday or today and I don't think they got pictures, something about the pictures didn't turn out but what do you think about them shooting at the moon? Leave a response comment telling me what do you think about it? So that's it for today thanks for watching and I'll see you later I guess